Hi guys. So Heather's out and you know, every time she leaves, she's always like, sell all the yarn. So, um, we're going to sell all the yarn. How's that sound? I am, um, going to show you our fingering weight yarns. We got a lot of really cool ones in this, um, right before fall started. So, um, because we know there's a lot of really killer patterns out there that call for fingering weight. So here, let me turn you around. We're going to look at the sock room and then the other ones that we have. Unfortunately, our pirate dyed yarn right now is boxed up, ready to go to Monroe with us tomorrow. So, um, we will look at what we have here and then we, um, we'll share what we have in Monroe too. Um, hopefully this weekend we will, we'll have it, we'll find a chance to share those with you. So, um, let me flip you around. Here we are in the sock room. Come over here. These are, um, this is a little heavier fing than fingering weight. It's a lovely yarn. Um, it's called Tweety Sport. It is a superwash merino nylon. Um, and this is a great yarn for a sock that you want to um, really wear. Really, like, it, it's toothy. It's a toothy yarn. Great yarn, hard wearing. Um, I'm going to go through and show you some of these. If you guys see anything that you want, if you could grab a screenshot and then Facebook message me. I can always get more pictures um, of the yarn and um, we can get you billed and it shipped out to you. So there's those. Um, the alpaca wool up here. Beautiful, soft, soft, soft yarn. Um, and here we have, this is, I have to read it upside down. Down. This is a superwash merino. I have a green, green and blue, darker blue and green. Um. Hi, Shelly. And then I have a little tiny bit of Lola bean left. Um. We can't wait to get more of that in. But first, we have to sell a little bit more yarn it's always the game sell the yarn buy the yarn we have two skeins of hot knit left um we have a little bit of madeline tosh in house then we're just doing sock weights so let it go across this is the silky merino great drape um fingering weight yarn a little heavier than fingering it's pretty darn awesome DK weight is what they have this labeled. Um, I really want something out of this. This is gorgeous, but I haven't done it yet. This is the Twist Light. They say this is a fingering weight. Sorry, flash that at you. It's a really awesome orange red, a cream and Tosh DK. I have heavier Toshes down below. If there is a one that you would like to see more pictures of, let me know. I have dandelions and daisies over here. Um, and this is all a superwash merino nylon blend. Super awesome yarn. I really dig this yarn. It's a lot of fun to play with. Um, kind of speckly tonals. Um, last bit of our... Lucky Rose up here. This is a Superwash Merino Nylon base. Okay. And then I'm going to swing you around slowly. This is, this shawl is done in the um, Lucky Rose in this pink and um, gold. It is gorgeous. I really love how they play together. So I'm going to come around. All of that is put away except for, this is really, really exciting. We got our own sock yarn in. It is a, it is a fingering weight. It is a fluffy fingering weight. 
because we like fluffy wool. Um, this is Shetland French Angora, and we have it in some tonal colors. So I'll go through. And this is some of our own dyed. This is really cool. I have one red maroon. It's really awesome. And then I have a few of these. These are dark because they are the BFL Angora blend. So here is the Shetland. The Shetland French Angora is the light colored ones. And the BFL, it's not BFL. Oh my gosh. Those say BFL. It's Corydale Satin Angora blend are the darker ones. So they're really yummy, super squishy. Love this yarn. Love it, love it, love it. Um, as always, we have our DK Little Bunny Tails. They are $15 a mini, and, and you can totally snag up a couple of these and make yourself a fun little warm cowl. They are made out of um, Merino, Corydale, or, um, oh, what else? Um, Corydale or um, Rommeldale blended with Angora. And as always, the Angora is from our bunnies, so then we know that they're well cared for. Out here we have, that was our Indie Dyed Room. So now we're going to come over, this is our commercial sock yarns. We have Perth. Perth is amazing. It is $13 for 437 yards. Almost every sock yarn that we have put up is in the 400 plus yard range. So we have Perth. Look at all those colors. Perth is a lot of fun. It is a slow self-striping gradient. Gradient kind of ish yarn um really pretty mauve orange and a green and orange pink and brown and it's a purple with light pink and then we got this really cool rainbow check that rainbow out i want rainbow socks somebody could make me rainbow socks this one's really cool. This is like um, tannish with mauve and a dusty blue. It's really pretty. I have one of that one left. Those are so cool. Um, so as you can see in the sample, this is what they stitch up like. Um, are these slow self um, striping? rose it's really cool so i have that one super cool this purple is amazing and then i have this green and gold that one reminds me of like i don't know why like frogs it's cool we have husko sock the husko sock wall makes me really happy it's it's like super cool and this is almost a solid um like speckly with little pops of color so if you're like knitting it you'll have like little pops of these solid colors that show up um in your knitting like this one will have like just two three stitches that have black and blue um and the rest of it is this nice gray. If you're crocheting, it'll only be one stitch of that pop of color. Um, it works really well for both crochet and knit. All right. And then we're going to walk around. Go, I'm going to go slow. Try not to make anybody dizzy here. Um, then I'm going to go around to the other side and show you some of our other sock yarns. Um, other fingering weights. I have a little bit of Marisol left here. This is a classic variegated. This is the Kushka. It's really a lovely feel. Um, make a lovely shawl, great drape. Um, I have the KFI um, 
indulgence hand um, painted. It is really cool. Um, these pops of color are longer than the Husco sock, so you'll have stripes of little of a little bit of color. Um, it's a great for knitting your socks. So again, that's a sock yarn with nylon in it. I also, for our non-wooled friends, I have a cotton blend for you, cotton polyester. This is $20 for, I mean, finding the label here to read it, 380 meters. And I have these lovely colors, look at that. They're just stunning. And then this is what it looks like worked up. It is also a self-striping yarn. So we'll go over here. I also have the online sock. And if you are interested in online sock, I can snap you pictures and send you all of the pictures so you can pick from there. Um, online sock is a self-striping, self-patterning sock yarn which is set up for when you do socks that it does it like that. So come over here to find more fingering weight. We're going to come down and look. This is a little heavier than fingering. This is our Sunshine Coast. Um, it is also a self-striping yarn. And then I have Drover. Drover is an amazing yarn. This would make the best cardigan. It's a merino silk tweed. Again, it's a little bit larger than fingering. Totally would make a killer cardigan. Um, but in fingering, we're going to come over here. We have these great giant... Um, United for some balls. I have it in purple. It's a gradient. These colors that are in it, I have it in purple. I have it um, black, charcoal to a silver and cream. And then this lovely red, orange, peach, gold. I have a purple, pink, gray, cream. And this lovely gr uh, dark green, light green. That's kind of a, I don't know, it's kind of brown, but not really a brown. It's a warm brown and a light green, like a spring green. And we also have with those, these great big ones are, oh my gosh, they are $25. The great big United balls are $25, and they are 1,531 1, yards. So if you're looking for yardage or making a big shawl or something of that nature, that is a really great yarn. You could do a blanket. Um, we have the little United balls of color. So, um, you can see there's some back there that are snuck back there my wall fell down I had all them all stacked up as a wall and they took off so these are these little guys are um 251 yards for them they are super cute and with a lot of yardage seven dollars so you can make something really cool um very reasonably with those and then I have more and more and more and more you say fingering weight holy cow I have fingering weight or they're close to so that it would be so much fun this is a slightly heavier again but this yarn is amazing this is the Marisol Nunya it is a merino silk it's wool silk, it says wool, but it feels like merino. 
just doesn't have the name merino on it um and i have it in a full rainbow this all of them great drape it's just gosh this yellow oh this yellow is so shiny sunshiny so if you want to make something very very yummy for yourself this is definitely look at this um we are at this is a 191 yard skein so you get good yardage and um it is $14 so very affordable for something really 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 yummy so my tags are upside down and then I'm gonna come over here I have to walk around the walk the great wheel we also have the rainbow beach rainbow beach is also fingering weight um, and I have it in a ton of colors let me get it where there's no glare Look at all these colors even black so often we shy away from black because it's black I love that skein right there that one's my favorite somebody should buy it so I don't because I don't need it I have like I'm gonna name it so look at all these colors Holy cow. This is a really great neutral. Matches everything. Nice warm taupe brown kind of thing going on. Um, this is a really great one too. This kind of hides away. It's looks it's green and oranges. I know it sounds like so 70s. Kelly was watching and she hates that. But this is so pretty on so many people. Great colors. Um, this one's really awesome too. Check it out. Really awesome plum. Teals. So there you go. There is our Rainbow Beach. And I have a couple of cottons too. So I'm going to slip down to cottons. Take you for a walk. Cottons are up here by our front door, which come in from this the parking lot. You can come in and your cottons are right next to it. I have this really awesome Noro cotton, and it is a fingering weight. We'll, and it, all those colors, all of them. We have all the colors in this Noro. This is, I always have to look at them. Mira, it is really cool. I have a little bit of the Knitting Fever, um, cotton lace these are huge again these are amazing they're $30 it's a ring spun cotton gradient and it's 874 yards it is huge I got it in this and I got it in purple and pink I have it in this really killer cream to red and again, more of the pink. So it's really awesome. And then I have the Uluru. Uluru um, is either variegated or striped. And here, let me get this little string out. There's two of them. It is a little lighter than fingering, but you could totally use larger needles or larger hook and make yourself a really cool cowl. You don't have to always use the needle size recommended. This says it's a super fine, like a lace, 
but you could use it as in something for a fingering weight very easily. So, and as you can see, um, it has quite a few yards, 410 yards, and that is for $12. So we have lots of things for you. Lots of things. Um, just let us know what you need and we can ship it out to you. More Uluru. Got lots of Uluru in our cubes. So, there you guys go. I will let you go. My hair is like crazy today. And, um, go through, shop. If you see anything you need pictures of, I will totally take pictures and Facebook message them back to you. So, Messenger works good for us. Um, Heather and I both check it. And, um, then we can get them shipped out to you. All right, you guys have a great day. Bye.